Lamb Surname Meaning and History, presented by COADB.com. Surname Meaning, it is an English occupational surname denoting a keeper of lambs. Alternatively, it could have developed as a nickname for a gentle, meek, or inoffensive person from the Middle English word lamb, meaning lamb. Early bearers included Edward Lamb of Kent around the year 1170 AD, William Le Lamb of Cambridgeshire in 1273, Richard Le Lamb of Northamptonshire in 1273, Adam Lamb of Scotland in 1288, Thomas and William Lamb of Scotland in 1376, and John Lamb of Scotland in 1379. Noble titles held include the Lamb Baronetcy of Brockett Hall in the county of Hertford, created in the Baronetage of Great Britain in 1755 for Sir Matthew Lamb, a British barrister and politician. Here we see Brockett Hall. Sir Peniston Lamb, the second baronet, was elevated to the peerage of Ireland as Baron Kilmore and was further raised to a Viscount Melbourne in 1781. And we see his children here, William Lamb, who was the second Viscount, Frederick Lamb the third, another son, the Honorable Peniston Lamb, and a daughter, Emily, who became Viscountess Palmerston. And here we see the family estate, now in color. Next is landed gentry. There was Lamb of West Denton and Temin, Richard Westbrook Lamb, born in 1826, descended from Richard Lamb, Esquire of Seat Hill in County Cumberland, who was born in 1680. Notables included Charles Lamb, an English essayist, poet, and antiquarian best known for his Essays of Aaliyah and for the children's book Tales of Shakespeare, co-authored with his sister Mary, who we see here, Marianne Lamb, born 1764, an English writer. She suffered, she suffered from mental illness, and in 1796, she stabbed her mother to death during a mental breakdown. John Lamb, born 1735, was an American soldier, politician, and anti-federalist organizer. During the American Revolutionary War, he led the 2nd Continental Artillery Regiment. William Lamb, born 1835, was an American newspaper editor, politician, businessman, and soldier, noted for his role as Confederate States Army officer in commanding the Confederate garrison at Fort Fisher. And John Lamb, born 1825, senior fellow, and son of Reverend Dr. John Lamb, Dean of Bristol. And lastly, John Lamb was an English astrologer and quack physician who, by around 1625, served the first Duke of Buckingham as his personal advisor. And he was accused of black magic and rape and was stoned to death by an unruly crowd in London. Early settlers included John Robert Thomas Edward and Elizabeth Lamb, who came to Massachusetts in 1630. And then over to Canada, you had Richard Lamb, who came to Newfoundland in 1714, and Patrick Lamb, who came to Nova Scotia in 1749. And if you enjoyed this video, please visit us at coadb.com, where we offer genealogy research. Link in the description. Thank you very much.